Okay, so one of the points I really want to hit home when it comes to figuring out how to start content and if it's going to be good or not is that you just need to start. So too often we think we try and think ourselves through whether or not an audience is going to like it or not and we don't let the audience tell us if it's good because we're so caught up with wondering uh, being worried about if we're going to be judged or not. So let me show you as an example what it takes and you have to just start because in order to look back and analyze what content works and what doesn't uh, you need content in the first place. So let me show you an example. I've been trying to really implement this in LinkedIn. So I've been posting uh, daily on weekdays now for almost a month and then when that's in place what you can do is you can go look at a history of all of your posts and then identify the ones that really seem to ring. Um, so you can see looking at what I've got this last one had 800 views and 16 engagements 6, 250, uh, 1600 so that was a little bit better uh, 3000 right so as you start seeing what rings and what doesn't that'll help you understand uh, a little bit more what it is about it to that like your audience liked some of that will be within the content of the post whether you used images videos or just text how you formulated it how uh, you know how you engage with other folks um, and you can learn a lot too from the comments or lack thereof uh, as well uh, I like to do the same exercise with uh, other people I I follow so uh, one great example that I'll come up is Daniel I've been following his for a while his stuff for a while um, you just go down to their activity feed you go see all you then you can just limit it to their posts and then you can take a look okay so he had uh, and with him he's got a big enough of a following now that I uh, I like to look at um, the engagements and comments kind of uh, together uh, and obviously I can't see his views uh, so 327, 600, 700, 400, 5, let's see, so 3, 4, 4, 27, 150, 4, 4, 12. All right, okay, so this one really went well. All right, so he had this 13 college crashes I wish I had. He came up with this list. Wonder what people would add. Topic. Okay, so... <clears throat> See, as you go through this, you can identify things. There's there's just a library of content that you can out there within your niche that you can analyze and um, try and figure out what it was about it that rang true. And then learn from it. Don't copy it. Don't plagiarize. But learn from it and uh, create your own. And, you know, add your own two cents to provide value to the community. So... The key is you just got to get started so that you can learn and figure out what it is that people want.